Thanks. A beach erosion control project has new life today, months after it was washed away. Palm Beach County Commissioners voted down the $30 million project back in March. News Channel 5's Mike Trim tells us tonight why commissioners are opening the door once again. Mike? Shannon, the commission chairwoman tells me after this plan was voted down, one of the commissioners who voted no saw a new presentation on erosion control and wanted to hear more. That opened the door for today's meeting. Arnold Gibbs owns two condos here on Singer Island, and placing anything on the beachfront to stop erosion is something he hopes can be done carefully. If they're an eyesore, I don't know that I'd be thrilled about it. What could be put here was hashed out at a Palm Beach County workshop, putting 11 limestone boulders called breakwaters off the shore to stop erosion was voted down in March. Wearing vote yes stickers, dozens of Singer Island homeowners want something done. Make sure the commissioners know that we do care and we are out there and they have to consider our feelings. Many here feel frustrated that their beach, their backyard, is washing away each year. The Army Corps of Engineers said at this meeting it will reject an erosion control plan unless the breakwaters are underwater or submerged. The current plan has breakwaters both under and out of water or emerged. People opposing this erosion control project are worried about what you see behind me. Let's take a closer look. Singer Island has long been a spot for sea turtle nesting, which is what you see taped off here. And you can see dozens of these all up and down the island. Balancing a project that is environmentally and homeowner friendly is something the county wants to do. Commissioners told the county environmental resources management team to develop a new plan. Now, I think now the board has recognized the importance and the value between the turtle nesting, the property values, and the hotel tourism com component to go and do something. And the Surfrider Foundation, which is against the current project, tells me it was happy with the meeting today, calling it common sense to find an alternative erosion control project. By the way, there's no timetable on when a new plan will be up for a vote. I'm Mike Tramp for WPTV News Channel 5.